Hello, I'm doing my first ever review of a product. I know it's back to front, but it's Huskaloo and it's supposed to be fantastic cat litter. Now it's 18 pounds a packet locally and it's supposed to last for 28 days. Let's see. I've already done Debussy's, um, I have to keep my words polite here, um, litter tray. That's the correct word, isn't it? I've done it and it says it only takes one of these and that it only takes 30 seconds or under a minute for it to be usable. Hmm. No, it doesn't. So I'm going to try and be as quick as I can. I don't be a very, very long video. So I am genuinely cutting this open. Uh, if you are cutting, always cut away from yourself. Cut towards somebody else. No, I'm only joking, but never cut towards yourself. So that's the brick. And I'm putting it in here. Hopefully you'll be able to see it as I pour in the water. That's it there, look. Now it says you need only one of these and you wait 30 seconds. I'm reviewing a product called Huskaloo. It's cat litter. And I'm pouring it in gently and it is very hot. It's a paper cup. And it says you just wait 30 seconds. Now, the difficulty with anything like this that is completely dehydrated and compressed is I think the water will only get to one side, well, which is what I thought. I've already done one, as I said. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29 and 30. But we'll add another five on because I spoke quite quickly. So if I chatter just for a couple of seconds, then you'll see hopefully what's happening. If I tilt this forward, you can see. So it's no longer now that size. Because there it is. It's about two, three times the size. But if you look also, you'll see it's still completely dry here. It's also still completely dry on the side that I can't show you. A little note, by the way, to manufacturers of litter trays. Why do you make them with holes in here? You know, indentations in here? Because that's where the poo always goes, and that's where the litter always sticks. So don't, if you're going to make it, don't, no ridges, none of this nonsense. Make all the ridges in the outside, and make it completely flush and flat on the inside. Right, so that's about at least a minute, I reckon. Now, that's that side, so I'm doing this live on camera, so I'm not cheating in any way. It's bone dry there. As I say, I've done this already. Now, where did I put the cup? The cup is here. That's the cup that they recommend. Okay, and they say, fill this to the brim, pour it on and wait 30 seconds. So I'm gonna do it again. This has two of these, and I've already put one in. And it is very, very hot. Hopefully you can see. So I'm pouring again. I'm not trying to pour too quickly. I'm not trying to um, circumvent what I think has potentially a really, really good product. But that's two of these, not one. And that's it. Right, so now I've got to wait another 30 seconds. I can't fast forward because I'm doing it live. Um, it's called Huskaloo Cat Litter. Coconut Cat Litter. It's 18 pounds locally at the fabulous Michelle Botts in the boat. Do please go and um, support them because they support our favorite charity. And they support a number of charities, but they support our favorite charity, which is Guernsey Animal Aid, the 100% volunteer run charity in the Bailiwick. Now, there might be absolutely nobody watching. They're probably bored with me already. But anyway, I am going to post this to YouTube as well. So that must be at least another 30 seconds. Then it says what you do is you break it up. Okay, so I'm gonna pick it up to break it up. And you'll see it does, it really does break up. Now, one thing I really do like about this product is that it will look like the real environment for the cats. As in, you know, outdoors where they would better, uh, they would bury stuff in, in um, soft litter outside. Now this one seems to have worked a bit better but it's still dry in the middle. You'll see what I mean. That's still quite solid. And so what I did with the other one is, I added another cup of water. So it actually, for me, it takes three cups of quite hot, it's only tap water, you don't need to boil it. 
and pour that on. And I turn it over quickly before it starts to rise. But even that, actually, I don't think is enough. I think it really needs about four cups, four of these. Um, doesn't say how many mills are in it, but, but I think it takes four of these. So I'll dispute that with the, uh, the manufacturer. But look, that's how it looks. So that looks like a cat's natural outdoor environment when it's coming to do a wee or a poo. So in that respect, it's very good. Ah, now that, that is now, look, that's now completely broken up, look. You can still see it's still quite dry in places, but now it's really usable. Very, very warm. And that's not just because of the hot water, but that's because of the, the reaction to whatever is in the husk uh, in a composting way. The other, other claim that they say is that this doesn't need to go to landfill, which I support fully. It means that even when the cats have done their business and you take out, separate out the poo especially, um, that you can then compost this again. And I think that's just amazing, absolutely amazing. I don't want the video to be too long. Now, I'm trying to show this without damage in my camera. That's not a lot of litter, okay? Now you might say, what have you got, a lion? No, I haven't, but I've got three cats. So I would actually do this with two bricks at a time, because to me, that's just about enough for a cat, because cats like to dig. They really do, they like to dig and dig and dig. And it smells absolutely lovely. I have washed this um, litter tray out with uh, bleach and so on and disinfectant so that it smells different whenever the cats come in. But their sense of smell is so strong that they will still know that this is their litter tray. Hang loose, stay tight as always. I will see you on the other side and I'm going to do uh, a product review of this over the next month. It says it does 28 days. Well, it won't do 28 days with three cats. It might do 28 days with one tiny cat um, that kind of uses the litter tray about this size. But I still think it has the potential to be a fantastic product. I'll let you know whether or not it's any good. As always, big love, and I'll see you on the other side. Bye now. Thanks for watching too.